first of all, the word effectively is an overstatement because I'm very honest in telling you that I was not the perfect mom, the perfect executive, perfect daughter, perfect daughter, and I was not. I juggled through all of those. And at every point in time, um, somebody would remind me that I wasn't available here, I wasn't quite there. And, you know, because the job needed me and I was responsible for so many people, I prioritized PepsiCo first because 260,000 employees were looking for the CEO to provide direction. And then between my husband and I, we somehow managed all of our other priorities and the extended family. The thing I'm envious about, Lila, is the technology that we have today. If I'd had, uh, you know, all of these uh, teleconferencing technologies, FaceTime, the chat, the talks, um, can you imagine I could have actually gone home at 3.30? I could have spent time with the kids, taking the kids off the bus, and then continued working from home. I need not have traveled as much as I did. I was on the plane all the time. I need not have done that because I, I could have done a lot of meetings through these technology tools. Okay, so in a way, I wish all of this technology had been available when I was a CEO. Uh, or maybe even when I was president, because that's when I had to travel a lot. My kids were even smaller because I could have spent a lot more time with them. Uh, and so I would say to all of the young people today, take these technology and the tools that you have as a gift and figure out how to engineer a support structure around this. And... Uh, I am a bad example of a person that traveled all the time, was in the office all the time, because I had no choice. You have the benefit of fantastic technology tools that are only gonna get better. If Google has its way, you're gonna make things way <laughs> better than they are today. I have great confidence in your company, all right? So, and the only key thing is, here's a, here's a request. You should tell your Google leaders, Put family and women in the center when you're, just, when you're developing these tools so that you make it easier for them to build young families and for women to not have to take a disproportionate share of the workload. Put families and women in the center of technology development. I think magic could happen. 